up here, what's the word? Yeah, yeah Baby girl, what you want from me? I cannot give you company She told me that she like my melody I was gonna y'all just gonna get straight to this video man I should not have to talk or anything in this video bro I'm just gonna show y'all the clips literally if y'all want to see how I dribble there's other clips but I don't even I, I feel like I'm way more better even after like two more three days of playing I feel like I can do way more I'm better at crabbing already and yeah this video was supposed to go out two days ago but I just now got the time to edit it because I have been riding double rep but yeah this tutorial is basically for beginners you know just you know to get open easy if you're not used to iso bro these clips trust me bro these uh these moves i'm about to teach you will help you get open like i'm telling you but yeah i'm about to give y'all my dribble moves real quick and uh yeah make sure y'all like this video because y'all know i haven't did a hand cam and literally have i ever All right, so now I try my dribble moves. I'm gonna finally get into the, the my favorite dribble moves I like to do. Teach y'all how to do them real quick. Just make sure you have my dribble moves on. And I'm not saying those are the best dribble moves because I'm still working around with it. I switch my moves a lot. But yeah, this is what I use mostly for the most part. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys my favorite move I like to do first, which is a couple between the legs, speed boost, then get a behind the back. But that's not the animation you're looking for. You will get that animation times, sometimes. Do that. Why does it that animation? Why do I have cold spots? That animation right there. You can create so much space by doing that at the park, y'all. I'm telling you. I killed so many people off that. Boom. That right there creates so much space and you can green it too. So basically, how you do that, if you don't know how to do this already, basically, this tutorial is for beginners, like people who really just want to just be able to dribble, you know, kill. You can do anything with this speed boost out of that and then dunk. Cause I do have a new player that's a more of a slasher type player and I still will use that move. But this, this move will get you open for threes and just, you know, catch the defender off guard. Cause they will try to catch up to you and if you want, you can just go dunk, you know, simple, easy. So uh, yeah, how you do this, basically if you don't know how to do the Kobe escape, you don't hold R2 and just keep, flick the right stick up. And basically just momentum, oh my God, speed boost out of it. What you want to do is Flick the right stick up, then hold R2 in the direction the ball is already in. It's like, say, the ball is my right hand. If I flick the right stick up, it's gonna the ball is going to switch to my left hand. And if the ball switches to your left hand, you hold R2 down and just go that way. So let me show you guys what it looks like. I know most of y'all know this already, but I just want to make sure. Because some people, you know, I just started playing this game again. I already know how to do it, but I just want to break it down for, you know, there's always people out there who really don't know anything at all. So look, up that direction. But that's not the animation you're looking for. Boom, boom. That's that's what you're looking for. So yeah. And after you uh, are going in that direction full speed, all you wanna do is hold R2 down while you're going in that direction like this. Let go of the left stick. And then flick the right stick diagonally down right. That's literally it. A little bit simple. As you can see the uh, hand cams right here. So boom. And you will get the animation side. So boom, boom. I don't know why he's consistently giving me it. But yeah, like that. Boom. 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 And you can like do, you can do that. You can basically spam that move, but I wouldn't recommend it. I would say you do it like every once every blue moon to catch the defender off guard. Cause if you keep doing it, they're gonna expect it. And you could do this move standing still too, but I prefer to do it off the speed boost because I think you go in that direction. Then you just slide back to the right and vice versa, bro. Like say the ball is going up, it starts off with my left hand, up, go that direction, same thing. But that's like one of my most effective moves I do. If you can see in my clips, that's one of the moves I catch people up, to catch, catches people off guard all the time. So that move is just OP. All right, so down to my second move that I like to do a lot. This move will catch people off guard too, but it's really like you you mostly shoot the three out of this move. Like you can drive, but I prefer to shoot three out of it because it's really consistent. So basically what you wanna do is this between the legs, to a spin, stop, green. 
that move is so consistent. It's really easy to catch, especially the bum player, like just at the park. It's really uh, easy to do. And uh, yeah, like it's, you should get this down your first try. You, you need basic one spin for this. So if you have basic one spin, you should get this down your first try. It's not hard at all. So yeah, basically all you wanna do, the ball is in your left hand, right? Say the ball starts off in your left hand. You wanna go for like this, right? We're gonna flick the right stick diagonally down right. So the ball goes between my, my legs while I'm moving. So you're gonna get boom. And after that animation, basically you just wanna, is it counterclockwise? I don't even know. Oh yeah, it's clockwise. Basically, after you get that animation between the legs, you wanna rotate the right stick while still holding R2 and everything and going forward. Wait, do I go forward? Oh yeah, yeah, you can still go forward. Basically, after you just do the, this between the legs, you wanna rotate the right stick clock, oh my God, clockwise. I haven't did a tutorial so long. Man, I need y'all to like this stuff because this is really awkward for me, man. I'm not used to explaining the directions of my controller. But you want to rotate the stick clockwise, like let's say four, or like it could be like, it could be three, it could be three, four to like seven o'clock. You can see right here, so boom. Just watch my fingers, watch my fingers. Boom. And then you're gonna get that animation and then to quick stop after it, all you want to do is flick the right stick down. So we're gonna put this in fast motion. Make sure I watch the controller. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, where you do that? But yeah, that move catches a lot of people off guard. It's good, easy clips, kills, you know, all that other stuff. Easy move to do. All right, for the next move to do, basically you really have to learn this move on your own. You have to feel this move out because this is really hard for me till this day to do. Well, not really hard for me. I'm just not used to it. I don't play 2K20. I'm really, I'm really starting to play this game a lot now for y'all, bro. I just want to start getting back to YouTube. I got a lot of free time, so... You know, all I need y'all to do is like this video for me, show love, but I'm gonna start really grinding this game, maxing out my players. Might hit elite too, that's my goal. But uh, yeah. But this move, basically, crabbing people, it really depends on uh, to get the player behind you. It's really just this crossover, bro. You can, you, there's no, it all depends on how your defender is playing defense on you. Like if he's playing on balls on you, or like you're using screens, he's really playing up, you can crab him, it all depends on him. But just know if you shoot off, off this, um, off that hesitation, it could be uh, green a lot, like if they're behind you. Like if you can get them behind you, but I really can't explain. How, like it, you can't like just put somebody behind you unless they're playing on ball. This is a certain type of defense they have to play. But just know y'all can work on that. I have a clip of me doing it in the video. All right, that's another move I can do, crabbing. But all you wanna do if you wanna know how to do that like guard one animation, all you want to do is flick the, like say the ball's in your right hand, literally hold R2 and flick the right stick to the left or flick the right stick back, I guess. That's simple, bro. And uh, last but not least, remember you guys, there's not a lot of advanced moves in this video. This is for like basic, basic stuff. I know more than this, like, let me show you. I could do some like, like, I don't feel like explaining all that. Let's see how many likes we get on this video and I'll get all technical and try to do like some more complicated stuff. Cause I could do a lot more than what I'm showing you guys. Just, you know, let's see how we, let's see how we do with this video. Oh, I don't have the right spin on, that's what it is. I have basic one spin on. I really don't use basic one like that, but I'm using it for this video because it's really like easy to dribble with. Like if you're a beginner, like I'll say use pro four or anything else. If you're like more advanced, you do a lot more with pro four. But uh, yeah, moving on to the last thing, I'm just show you guys how to do the quick stop. Basically, all you wanna do is speed boost to one direction, let go of everything on your controller, and then shoot the ball. That's really it. Because instead of a hesitation, usually people just shoot off of this, you know, just step back. But with the quick stop, you're just shooting like straight, like you speed boost and shoot. Like, it won't give that defender time to even think about you're about to shoot. Like, let go, shoot. That's really it. Let go of everything and just shoot. That's this. I don't even know why people make a whole tutorial about on how to quick stop when it's that simple, you know? Yeah, okay, literally, speed boost. Ooh, and if you don't let go of everything, you get that animation. That, that was a good example, you know? You, I have to show y'all what it's like if you don't do it right. So boom. Green. So that's really it for this tutorial, man. I just wanted to, you know, make some for y'all, but let me know how y'all feel about this tutorial. If y'all want a more advanced one, show y'all some different moves. I, I don't know, like I feel like I could teach y'all way more than this. But yeah, like this video up, sub if y'all new. About to hit 100K, and I'm out. 
But yeah, man, make sure y'all subscribe if y'all new. I know I kind of sound sick. I hope that's not. It better not be Corona. Mom, I have a lot more uh, video tutorials dropping because I'm really in the mood for to start posting and grinding.